Clifford's Family by Norman Bridwell. I'm Emily Elizabeth, and this is my dog. His name is Clifford. We live in a small town now, but we were both born in the city. One day we went back to visit our old home in the city. Clifford hadn't seen his mother since he was a tiny puppy. She hardly knew him. She still treated him like a puppy. She checked his teeth and she looked at his ear to see if he had been washing them. The man told us where Clifford's brother and sisters lived. We went to find them. Clifford's sister, Claudia, lived nearby. She was taking her owner for a walk. We went to the park with them. A taxi was blocking the crosswalk. Clifford took care of that. Next we found his brother, Nero. Nero was a rescue dog at the fire station. While we were there, the alarm rang. We followed the truck. Nero rushed to the building. Clifford helped him. Nero was very brave. Then we set off to the country. Clifford's other sister, Bonnie, was a farm dog. One of Bonnie's job was to herd the sheep into their pen. Clifford wanted to do some farm work too. He started to drive the cows towards the barn. One of the cows was a bull, and the bulls don't like the color red. Clifford wasn't scared. He was smart. He didn't want to hurt the bull, so he jumped out of the way. When Clifford jumped, he really jumped. We had one more place to visit. It was Clifford's father's home in a town nearby. The house was small, and there were a lot of kids playing in the yard. Clifford's father didn't have a collar, or a dog dish, or a dog house, but he seemed very happy. I guess it was the kids. He sure loved kids. He was a lot like Clifford, just a little smaller. Clifford wished his family could come and live with us, but they all had people who needed them. Just as I need Clifford, the best dog of all.